Welcome back, YouTube family. This is Sub Zero. Back in another video just for all of you guys. If you guys are paying attention, this is part two of the ultimate hill climb initial D Sub Zero uh, build for my Subaru WX STI 2021. Uh, last video, we got the pulley cover on, we got the fender shrouds on. We also got the Grim Speed uh, Pit Stop Mount on. We got the IAG AOS on. We got the Coil Rad Radiator on. In this video, we are going to be doing a bunch of interior stuff. I also want to let you guys know that in the last video, I did not mention it, but I did get the IAG engine mount and I got the IAG transmission mounts. Um, we went ahead and did that when we got the uh, pit stop mount in. I forgot to mention it. <laughs> like I said, there's so many mods that we're doing with this car. Uh, but yes, I went and got the IAG engine mounts and the transmission mounts and the uh, Grim Speed pit stop mount. The sounds the car makes, it is much louder, but it sounds so racy. It, the car feels really sturdy, really strong, um, and we got a lot of modifications to go. We got the entire garage set up just for this build right here. I got all my wrench and tool kit. Like I said, I'm learning how to wrench. I'm learning how to do uh, and use tools on my car. So please uh, bear with me. Um, give me some teachings. Give me some tips. Give me some pointers in the comments below, guys. In the comments below, let me know any some uh, tricks that you guys might have. Like I said, this is going to be my try all test all demo as far as trying different things out on the car but anyway y'all today we are going to be installing the cart boy short throw shifter with a whole bunch of stuff the racing shift knob the racing um reverse lockout kit we also have the white line positive uh for the shifter and a whole bunch of other parts going in if you guys like the video hit the like button if you want to subscribe to the channel hit the subscribe button and like i always keep saying guys be your own hero, because the world needs more heroes, and we all have the power to be one. Let's get into the video. Let's get it. Peace. All right, heroes, like I was saying before, with a lot of these installs, I don't want to necessarily waste too much of your guys' time with the actual install process, mainly because I know a lot of people have already done these installs on other pages, other channels. What I really want to show is the quality of these products, and the quality of these products, especially when you're driving. You know, I really want to show how it is driving, my reviews how it's driving, the pros and cons of it driving, my reactions, my feelings of it, how I think these mods are things you guys should or should not do. And I've seen a lot of installs where people will take, you know, most of the video talking about the actual install, but they don't really talk about their expectations of it, the reviews of it, and if you really should do it or not. You see how it looks, you see the process, but is this something that you guys should all actually do for your Subaru. Installed, I might do some installs um, on some products or things that I feel like aren't out there as much. All right, you guys, so the first thing that I got installed on this car is going to be the Cart Boy Short Throw Shifter and Bushing Combo Kit. I got it installed um, and I have to, I cannot recommend this enough. I know there's other short throw shifters in the market. I know Cobb has one. I haven't had experience with it. I know STI um, creates their own short throw shifter kit. That's about $500. The Car Boy, hands down, my favorite, not because I just have on this car, but I've seen the others in person. And this, for the price, $200 is so, so worth it. Um, it's so short. The, the shifts are very short, very precise. I really, really like how the, the car shifts and feels. But with that, make sure you guys go ahead and get the White Line Gearbox Positive Shift Kit. The, and the next thing I got as well is the Torque Solution Solid Shifter Linkage U-Joint. It just goes hand in hand with that, making everything precise, everything just easy, like everything is just stable. It just feels so good. When you're trying to wiggle it, it does not wiggle, it does not move, it's steady, it's stiff, it's, it's compact.
Alright y'all, so overall, I am very, very satisfied and so happy just with the mods that we've done so far. Man, we're only continuing to grow. We are so close to 19,000 subscribers, guys. We're under 100 away. So if you guys have gotten this far to the video, make sure you guys hit the like button. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. And like I always keep saying, guys, go after your dreams and make them reality and be your own hero because the world needs more heroes and we all have the power to be one. And I just want to say for myself, just thank you guys so much for the support. Just... Everything that you guys do, all of the comments, all of the likes, it really goes a long way as far as helping with this build, helping with this channel, and helping me be able to provide all these things for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy my videos. Like I said, I'm trying to do something a little bit different. I know some of you guys might be disappointed and want to see the whole install process, um, but I just feel like everyone has already done those install processes, so I really want to show you guys exactly just my reviews of everything I do, why I do everything I do, and kind of talk about the benefits and the pros as to why you guys should also do these things too. And I don't want to make like three videos of literally the exact same thing I talk about, one doing the install, then a review, then a driving review. I'm trying to just condense it all to one video. So if you guys collect, so that way if you guys watch this video, you can see how it looks, you can see how it drives, and you can get a better understanding as to why you guys should or you shouldn't do these modifications because not all mods are for every single buddy or every single person. Anyway, everybody have a blessed day. Take care of each other. Peace, y'all.